Over the past few years, we managed to take down some truly remarkable animals in Call of the Wild, and thanks to you guys and your unbelievably amazing ideas, we can now put them all in one trophy lodge and see them all at the same time. Ladies and gentlemen, I now present to you the Hashtag Hunters Ultimate Trophy Lodge of all time. Every single thing that you see here when you walk in is going to be either a diamond or a rare. Now pretty much the entire trophy lodge is full, so I'm not going to be able to go around to every single animal, but I'll try and do my best to kind of like the coolest parts of the trophy lodge. For instance, right when you walk in here, we're going to have a big diamond OG red deer stag with an albino red deer right here and a really cool multi mount. We have a diamond turkey right there, a gray leucistic goose, we have a big diamond kudu, a melanistic duck, a rare roe deer, and this part here is actually my favorite part of this trophy lodge because it has an entire wall full of diamond mule deer we have an og big rack diamond mule deer here we have a true rack diamond non-typical mule deer here it's actually pretty rare take a look at this 338.1 diamond mule deer right there and then we have a big true rack diamond mule deer here 318.9 so these two kind of came out during the same time but this one was definitely the better of the two racks and then over here we have another og big rack diamond as well 527.1 which is actually a huge diamond mule but then you come over here here and we have our biggest diamond muley right here this guy scored i think it was yeah 325.8 big rack diamond mule deer he looks incredible just like that and then we decided to put this right here this is our bighorn diamond cape buffalo and a diamond lion with two lionesses all in one multi mount right here that looks really really cool take a better view of that but honestly uh, I think this looks quite a bit better. I used to have just one main line here, and now that looks really, really cool. We'll go over here, and we have a whole wall full of diamond bighorn. As you can see, a 172, 172, and a 166 diamond bighorn. Then we have a diamond mountain goat, a diamond raider stag. Then you come in here. And we have this. This is really incredible. Our albino red deer stag and a piebald red deer as well. Come over here. We have a rare albino mouflon followed by a melanistic Iberian wolf, a winter wolf, and a prestige Iberian wolf. So all these wolves here are very rare and a really cool huge albino mouflon right there. That looks really sweet there. I actually like that a lot. Um, but anyways, then you come over here and we have a mountain goat, another diamond mountain goat. And then we're going to go over here. We're going to have a big melanistic grizzly bear and a huge albino grizzly bear. We're going to have a big diamond lynx, a female lynx, and one of my all-time favorite rare white tails. A huge 260 scoring rare piebald white tail buck. A 262 scoring rare piebald white tail buck with our biggest diamond white tail, a 290 diamond white tail right there. That looks really cool. These are all going to be diamonds as well. Diamond spring buck, goose, wild boar. Um, Iberian wolf and an access deer and then we're gonna have a diamond warthog right here This right here is our diamond coyote a diamond duck a piebald duck and a piebald uh, Hen duck as well our biggest diamond Rocky Mountain elk right here I think he scored like 505 we took him down with a longbow during a live stream then you come over here, we're going to have our trifecta of diamond white tails. We have kind of the OG diamond white tails and the new true rank diamond white tails. We have our biggest one is a 989. And uh, yeah, because I think these are all the old scoring system, but they are the true racks. So, and then you come over here, we have one of our bighorn diamond cape buffalo as well. This guy here scored uh, 995. This is actually kind of the old scoring system, but he is huge. We took him down out of the tripod. This is actually my outro of all my videos right here. This exact cape buffalo. Took him out of the tripod with the compound bow. Then you come over here, diamond gimsbach, diamond water buffalo, and our biggest diamond bull moose, 302 diamond bull right there. Actually, no, that's not even the right one. That's a 960 diamond. That's the old scoring system. Then we have our diamond grizzly bear here, a diamond pronghorn antelope right here. We'll come around this point here. We have a diamond white tail there, diamond white tail there. Actually, that's a spring buck. We have a melanistic duck there, our albino roe deer here, an albino wild boar there. Actually, that's not a wild boar, that's a warthog. A diamond black bear right there, 23.1. We have a diamond wildebeest right there. This whole entire hull is full of all diamonds right here. We have a diamond plains bison, diamond gimsbuck, diamond bighorn sheep, another diamond rocky mountain elk. But I just want to kind of like show you in slow motion here. So you can kind of see the whole perspective of our trophy lodge. I mean, this right here is really impressive, but come around this point here. We have a rare albino kudu. 
one of my favorite rares in this trophy lodge as well. We decided to put him with this uh, red brown female kudu. They look really, really cool together there. We have our biggest diamond and our only diamond fallow buck here. This whole entire wall here is full of diamonds. Those are all diamonds up there. And then you come over here and we have all of our turkeys in here. Well, most of them anyways. We have our rare melanistic gobbler, our leucistic gobbler, and our rare hen right there. Come over here, a diamond white tail, diamond bighorn, and another rare gray goose. Come over here, a diamond Rocky Mountain elk, a rare albino mule deer, diamond um, albino. Actually, it's not an albino. What is that? Actually, it's a white diamond feral goat that we got with the bow. We have a diamond mountain lion there, a diamond turkey there, and our diamond Sika stag right here. That scored 204, uh, actually 200, yeah, 204.2 red spotted. A diamond gemsbok, a diamond wildebeest, an albino plains bison, and another albino plains bison. So overall, I would say we definitely have one of the coolest looking trophy lodges around, and that's thanks to you guys. You guys were the ones telling me that we should put everything in one trophy lodge and kind of create like an ultimate trophy lodge. And uh, yeah, I think we definitely did that. <laughs> It's looking pretty awesome. I do have a couple of melting mounts left that I do want to put up, but I really don't have enough room. For instance, I want to put a multi mount right here, but I thought, you know what? This guy looks really cool here, so we'll keep him there. And then we have our multi mount over here. I just put this up today with our rare piebald white teal. This is probably one of my favorite mounts right now. Honestly, this is actually absolutely incredible. The fact that we have a diamond and a big rare piebald white teal, almost identical racks, just the only difference is the diamond has more mass than the pie ball. That's it. Otherwise, they both look pretty similar. Very incredible bucks. This is our big OG diamond red deer as well. We do have two of them. One is in the multi mount over there. And the second one is right here. We got one with the M1 and the other one we got with the bow. So this is the one we got with the M1. We got that one with the Hoikater. Hoikater, that's my bow. Uh, the Hawk Edge bow, we took that one. We took this one with the M1, but that one's gonna score 255 diamond red deer. I think we're gonna keep our third diamond OG mule deer here as well. This is gonna be a blonde, and this is gonna be our only full body mount for the OG diamond mule deer. And then we're gonna put another diamond lion that we have. Um, I wonder, the thing is, I have so many animals in my inventory here that it just takes forever to find what I'm looking for. And once I miss it, it's like it's gone. I'm really hoping we can put it here because I am not seeing any misc. We're going to put this here instead. We're going to put that here. That's going to look really cool. A big diamond true rack black tail buck in a diamond mountain lion or puma. I don't remember what it is. Is it a puma? It's a puma. I don't think we can quite put a lion in there for some reason. Like I said, we have one diamond lion here, a big horn diamond cape buffalo here. Um, where are we supposed to put another two diamond lions? Where are we supposed to put them? I just don't know. I mean, we could put them on the wall, but it's just not that impressive to me. I really like to be able to see kind of the full presentation of the lion. What I'm thinking is, I'm thinking about putting them right here. I'm thinking about taking this big wildebeest down, which it's not giant. It's, it's a big diamond, but... I think we're gonna put one of the lions right here because I don't have any other spots for him. 48.8 diamond, we'll put him right there for now. <sighs> I think I like him better like that. I think we'll keep him like that. Okay. I do actually have like six more diamond water buffalo that I have to set up here somewhere. And that reminds me, where the heck is our biggest diamond moose? Did I not set him up? I kind of forgot about this room actually. In this case here, we can put a couple of our water buffalo. Another one right there, another one right there. There's actually three of them that we're looking at. So we'll put the black diamond water buffalo there. And then we got this one here. This is actually an albino. So I think we'll keep him. Yeah, that's a huge albino, a 190 albino. And I found this one as well. So with that, that's gonna make three diamond water buffaloes and one albino rare water buffalo, a big one, but he wasn't quite big enough to make diamond. But that's gonna look really cool in this room here. There he is, 301.16 diamond bull moose. We'll put him up 
right there. That's a very, very special bull. We took him down with a 300 Magnum walking at about 315 yards. Probably my farthest diamond with a rifle in Call of the Wild right there. But yeah, anyways, let me know what you guys think. I hope you guys enjoy our tour of our new Ultimate Trophy Lodge here. Let me know what you guys think of it and uh, what else I should do because apparently you guys have the best ideas. Anyways, that's going to be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching and we'll see you next time. That's actually a dime potential white tail buck. He's going to score somewhere around like a 240, maybe 250. But if he breaks that 250 mark, he could definitely score diamond. He's up there at about 300 yards out, but I really don't like that angle. So we're going to try and score up on him here and get in a better position to take the shot. We got him about 250 right there, and I think we're going to take the shot. We're going to hold it right on that front shoulder, and hopefully we can get enough penetration to bust through and hit the opposite side. I was a little bit low on that, but I think we should have been all right. Yeah, we're definitely all right. He smoked. Let's go over and go take a look. Well, here's our buck down right here. Let's take a look at him. And yeah, it's going to be like a 240s white tail. It's a beautiful buck, but uh, just not quite big enough to break that 250s mark. Either way, we'll take a cool picture of him because that's a beautiful white tail. And let's pick him up. It's going to be a 239 gold, and yeah, just didn't quite make that 250s mark. Hit right behind the front shoulder at 255 yard, left lung, liver, and a stomach shot, and a great white tail down.